I'm Ashley Esqueva, and it's time for another installment of Just Show Me on Tekka TV, where we take your tech toys and gadgets and show you how to get the most out of them. Today I'm going to show you how to child-proof your iPad. Now, the iPad can be an amazing learning device for your kids. There are different apps that are educational and fun that they can use. Interactive books also make it a great thing for your kids to use, but there are definitely some features and abilities that you don't want your kids to have while they use your iPad and some apps that you might not want them using either. So we're gonna set up restrictions today. From our iPad home screen, we wanna open up settings. Now once we're in settings, we're gonna look for the general tab in the left-hand sidebar. What we're looking for is restrictions. So you'll see right now it says restrictions off. So we're gonna tap on that and it will take us to the restriction screen. Now we can tap on Enable Restrictions. Now once that happens, you'll get a pop-up window asking you to pick a passcode or a four-digit PIN. So pick a PIN that your kids aren't going to guess. One, two, three, four, zero, 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 zero. Not good options. Pick something difficult that they're not going to guess. And once we've done that, you will see all of the different options you have for restrictions. Now the very first section is Allow. Now here you can actually turn off or on apps that the iPad has pre-installed on them. You can actually shut those off and they will not show up on your iPad unless you disable restrictions. So you'll put in your pin, disable them, and then those apps will show back up again. What we're gonna do is we're going to shut off YouTube because YouTube is definitely not a place that you would want a small child surfing around on. And we're gonna shut off FaceTime and the camera as well. And we're gonna shut off the last two, which are the most important features, I personally think, which is installing apps and deleting apps. If you have any apps with important information on them, like I do, you definitely don't want your kids uninstalling those apps and getting rid of that data. Now, the second option is allow changes. Now, here we have location, accounts, and find my friends. So we're actually going to go into a location, and you'll actually see all the different apps that use location you can actually just shut off all location services by finding the location services tab and toggling it off. It'll give you a little message saying, hey, I just wanna let you know, this will also shut off Find My iPad. So make sure that you're only shutting this off when your kids are using it and not when you have your iPad out and about. The next section is allowed content. Now this one is really great if you're letting your kids watch videos but you don't necessarily want them watching that episode of Lost that you have waiting for you on your iPad. You can choose different rating levels for each different type of media. So you can choose music and podcasts, movies, same thing, rated G and PG movies and so forth. TV shows, same thing. Apps, you can actually find age levels for different apps and you can actually shut off the age levels. You can shut off in-app purchases, and you can actually choose when your password will be required to input. So usually it's 15 minutes, but if you'd like it to be immediately, you can do that too. The last option is Game Center. Now Game Center, if you're not familiar with it, is a network that you can use while you play games on your iPad. Now if you don't want your kids to be able to play multiplayer games with strangers you don't know that are on Game Center, you can shut multiplayer games off, and you can also turn off adding friends. We have set up our restrictions now. Once you're done, all you have to do is hit the home button and you will see that your iPad has been child-proofed. It is safe from the trials and tribulations of having a little one in the house using your technology. That's it for Just Show Me on Tekka TV. Be sure to check out Tekka.com for all of our other content and we'll see you next time.